Hey guys, I am here tonight to give you my stance on wrongful convictions. Um, I did look up a couple of the cases um, by the North Carolina Center of Actual Innocence website. And one of the cases that stuck out to me was a guy named Mark Carver. He was convicted, his conviction was overturned after eight years. Um, he was convicted of murdering, I'm assuming, a lady named Ira in Gaston County, North Carolina. He, um, it, uh, it's uh, wrongful convictions, you know, that's, that's a tricky subject anyways. Um, a lot of things have to be considered, you know, evidence, witnesses, you know, evidence mainly, but, um, uh, one of the things that the article or the summary said was that um, his um, attorneys didn't properly investigate the case before deciding whether or not to offer evidence, offer certain evidence at trial. Um, it's almost like it almost makes it sound like they didn't try. And one, I don't know if he this was a court appointed attorney or not. I know they kind of get a bad rap because they don't, a lot of people think that they don't put in the time or the effort because of their other, their other caseloads. Um, you know, they, they can be worked a lot, worked to death almost, but, um, they, um, also did not properly investigate his physical and intellectual disabilities. Um, and the failure to thoroughly investigate the key DNA evidence. Um, like I said, DNA is a big factor whenever it comes to stuff like this. Um, it's, it said that the new evidence made it doubtful at best that the DNA at the scene could be tied to Mr. Carver. So over time, um, whatever, over time, the, the new systems and the new processes, you know, that they, that they worked on, you know, that could definitely be beneficial to people that, um, have been wrongfully convicted. When, you know, it said, it also said that he, uh, was retired, you know, that, uh, can also take a toll on, on people. So, if, you know, they're wrongfully convicted, of course, they're going to lose their job. They're going to lose a lot of things. They're going to lose, you know, a lot of, um, you know, their friends, their family even. And it can just, it can really hurt somebody, you know, especially if they didn't do it. And like I said, again, it's, it's still tricky. You know, there's a lot of things we don't really know for sure, you know, in certain cases, unless, you know, it does have the physical evidence. And, um, so I'm glad that, you know, they can, um, you know, be overturned. Um, it's just, it all depends on the people that are so willing to help you do it. <laughs>